Hey guys, it's Crystal. I wanted to make a new video. Um, excuse my dog. He keeps barking at a chichara outside every time it makes noise. So today's video, I wanted to do what's in my toddler's bag that I carry. Um, I haven't done a video like this in a long time. I think the last time I did a video was uh, what's in my baby's hospital bag, if I'm not mistaken. I'll link it up here or somewhere or down below if you're interested in seeing that. Um, this bag is specifically for my 18 month year old. Um, I don't carry too much for my oldest daughter who's going to be four next month. Um, so she doesn't need too much stuff although I do carry some stuff in my backup talk about in a little bit. So if you're interested in seeing what I carry for my 18 month old please keep watching. So the bag that I use is from Target. My good friend got my oldest daughter this bag, but she has her own backpack for preschool, so she's letting her little sister use her bag for now. Um, the only downside on this bag is that it doesn't have a cup holder, um, so we just put the cup inside uh, if we're going to bring her an extra sippy cup or whatever. So on the outside, you can see I have a hand sanitizer. I have multiple of these. Um, even my daughter's um, big backpack has one. Um, I always like to carry it. You never know with these germs nowadays. Um, so on the outside, it has a front zipper. And we're going to go through this front one first. Here I carry all like band-aids, more sanitizer, stuff like that. So... I have extra boogie wipes. Right now my girls are under the weather right now, so having boogie wipes on hand is a plus. Um, I have tissue for them in this little baggie, Ziploc bag. These are Anpanman. If you haven't seen my Japan haul, I talk about these. If you're interested in watching that, click below or on top. I have band-aids, of course. If we have any accidents anywhere, I actually carry two different brands because my mother-in-law sent me some from Japan, but my eldest daughter is, I guess, kind of allergic to them because every time we put these on her, she breaks out in bumps. So she doesn't wear these, but the my 18-month-old um, wears these instead, and we carry regular Band-Aid brand as well. This is for my oldest daughter. If we happen to run out of the Japanese ones, then the 18 month old will use these. So, I have a spray hand sanitizer. This is from my work. I'm not going to show you because it says the name of it. But you just simply spray it on their hands and um, rub it in and they're good to go. I actually prefer this over the um, this kind because it dries quickly. I also carry a Up and Up brand pain relieving spray for those little accidents that we have. Hopefully we won't have any. Um, I carry for diapers, um, little baggies. I don't think I don't think they have a scent. I can't remember if I bought the ones that were scented. I can't really tell if it's scented, but anyways, they're little baggies for. Um, baby diapers because my 18 month is still in diapers I carry wipes hand sanitizing wipes I use these to wipe our hands just in case we run out of the other hand sanitizer I tend to also carry uh, wipes of Clorox um, that way when we go out to eat I wipe down either the tables or the high chairs because they always tend to be dirty like restaurants neglect to clean high chairs. I don't understand. <laughs> so that is what is in the front pocket of the backpack. So inside the bag, I have bug spray. My oldest daughter will also use this because every time she gets bit, she flares up. So. We tend to carry that and sunscreen, but I don't have sunscreen in here today. 
Um, I have the um, flushable wipes. These are by Prolapse. I actually uh, use the Up and Up brand more. I just had these in hand, so I just stuck it in there. Love these for potty training. Also, we're trying to transition to potty training, so these um, are definitely a must when we potty train. But I also like them for when we are doing diapers. I want to mention I do cloth diaper. If you haven't seen any of my cloth diaper um, videos and you're interested in cloth diapering, please check that out. Um, however, I do not cloth diaper when we're outside of the house or um, if my daughter's going to the babysitter. We tend to use disposables. So I have about 10 diapers in here. It's pretty full because she was at the um, babysitter, but I usually care about 10 diapers. I have snacks in here, just regular, these are animal crackers and snacks for my oldest daughter. Also, I have one change of clothes for the, my 18 month old. It's just a onesie. I prefer carrying onesies for her just because it's easy, it's less clothing that I have to carry. Um, I'm probably going to throw in some socks in here, I don't have socks. So, if we are going out in the weekend to a restaurant, then I will place her bib in there. And I usually put the utensils in here as well and roll it up and we're good to go. The cup that we like to use when we're out and about also is the Contigo. Both of my girls have one of these. Um, we only put water in it. We don't put no milk or juice. Um, really really love this cup never have any problems with leakage um, with leakage with leaking um, my oldest daughter's cup though I kind of use her error and I kind of messed up her inside of the cup so we have to get a replacement part for her because now it does leak but that was my fault so um, but these don't leak I love it we prefer these over sippy cups when we go out, but um, like I said, when she goes to the babysitter, she usually takes a sippy cup with her, so it actually fits in this backpack, and I put it on top if she's not carrying it, because I don't think this one will fit. No, it doesn't fit. So that is what we carry in our little bag. Uh, sometimes I'll put little toys in here if we are going out to a restaurant. Love to carry a few little toys here and there, but right now there's none in there because um, we're not going out. But if we do, I'll throw in some toys. Now this is my backup bag. This is if I forgot to put something in her little backpack, or maybe I ran out of something and I'm in a bind. Uh, this bag will always be in the car. There is nothing in here that's going to go bad as far as food. I don't keep food in here. Um, it is actually a wet bag. Again, if you want to check out my cloth diapers, um, hauls or whatever, this bag is in there. I got this from one of my, I believe, Kissed by the Moon. Um, I forgot what it's called. Anyways, it's like, um, you buy this package and it comes with a bunch of accessories and this is what I got in it. It's a wet bag. So if we have any accidents, I can use the wet bag and put um, soil clothing or whatever in this bag if need be. We actually have two of them. Um, so what I have in here are a big set of wipes. I have another hand sanitizer. I have a set of clothes for my oldest daughter just in case she has an accident. We haven't had any accidents. She's potty trained. But this is just in case she gets dirty, um, has an accident, whatever. So this is for my oldest daughter. Um, I have another set of eating utensils, just in case I forget to bring some. I have one little um, drawing pad. If I forget to bring toys with me or whatever, it will be in there. Um, I probably have to put the other one because I carry two, one for each daughter. Um, I have one set of clothes for my youngest daughter. Let's see if I can get it. I want to throw in another romper, but we're kind of outgrowing rompers and stuff. Like I said, I prefer to um, carry rompers instead of multiple clothing. It's just 
more clothing to carry. So once I get more rompers and stuff, um, I'll replace it with the romper instead of having these clothes. So I have a bunch of diapers in here as well for the baby, for my baby, for my 18 month old. Um, if I forget to bring a bib, I have disposable bibs. And I talked about these when we um, went to Japan. So if you're interested in seeing my what I carry in my toddler's travel bag, if I'm not mistaken, or baby's travel bag, I'll link everything up that you can check out. Um, but these are just extras that we had left over from our trip to Japan. So I have these just in case I forget our bib for any reason. I have extra tissues and I believe that is it. So here's the wet bag all empty. Like I said, if we have a mess, we could just throw in the clothing in there and we are good to go. I'll probably throw in a Ziploc baggie too if I do have to use this and put the other stuff in there. So this is my backup bag. If I forget something or run out of something. I just don't want to be hauling a big diaper bag anymore because both of my kids don't need that much stuff anymore. So yeah, I guess that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and maybe um, you guys will want to do the same thing. I don't know. Some people like to carry the big diaper bag. Um, I'm kind of over it already. I'm tired of carrying a big bag with me all the time. Um, like I said, my backup bag is going to stay in my car. And if I ever need something, I'll be ready for both of them. And as for the toddler bag, uh, sometimes it stays in the car. Sometimes I take it down if I feel like I need to add stuff to it. So um, we also like using this bag because my little one wants to be like big sister and carry a backpack around too. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please do so. I try and put out videos at least every two weeks. Um, I don't know, maybe not so much now. I'm back in school again. Um, so kind of busy with school, being a mom, being a wife, <laughs> and YouTube. So, um, But I try to put out videos at least every two weeks or so. So yeah, if you guys are interested in seeing what other videos I have coming up, please subscribe. <laughs> And thank you so much for all the new subscribers who have joined um, my YouTube family. Um, I really do appreciate it. And I guess that's it. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.